today we're going on an adventure. We are going to St. Pete. This is my Mother's Day's um, gift to my mom. Also, you know, her birthday because we didn't really do too much. So we're going to go down to St. Pete. We rented a cottage. She has no clue. Uh, Shea Bear came up with a story from a friend that he saying that we have to go to St. Pete to do a job to help him. So he wasn't able to go. So he came up with a story. So we told her yesterday. So she knows that we're going to St. Pete to do a job. But she doesn't know that we're going to stay down there for two nights and be there for three days. So stay on our adventure and see what happens. And I can't wait until we get there and, and then tell her that we're here for a couple of days. Been trying to pack the car without her knowing. Trying to get clothes out of her room without her knowing. <laughs> and it wasn't easy. And I don't know if she knows or not. She was on the phone with her sister yesterday, so as she was doing that, I was trying to get some of the clothes out of her room and trying to put them in my room. I don't know if she saw me doing it. I tried not to, but I mean, you know, it looks a little obvious I'm going in and out of a room. You know what I mean? So, anyways, she hasn't said nothing, so hopefully she doesn't know because I really would be a nice surprise for her. So hopefully we'll get down there. We're not leaving till one um, because we can't get in until three o'clock in the afternoon. So we're going to take her out for dinner, and we are we're going to take her out on the top of the roof um, restaurant. They have an elevator, so I can put her on the wheelchair, and we can go in the wheelchair. Sorry, there's cars going by, and. Um, I can take her to the rooftop then then you got a beautiful view up there just gorgeous view so we did it once the two of us together it's been probably about four years ago maybe and uh, yeah we had a good good time so I want to take her there and there's a couple of things I want to do tomorrow but I really the main thing is to get her to the beach and I want her to see the Sun coming down so that is the best thing part of St. Pete. So anyways, stay tuned and here we go on our adventure. First toolbox. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Where's the second oh, shit, one? Marty. It's out there. Where's the second one? Out there. Oh, do you need it now? I know what's going on, so you don't need to. What? What's going on? That's my suitcase. No. It's not Marty's. It's not for his tools. <laughs> I was thinking why anybody had to come from Inverness to do plumbing for somebody all the way down here. And they don't have any plumbers down here? Well, we're friends. I'm good. And, and you he, might be good. He trusts us, Marty. I'm Martin. damn good. Yeah, right. Yeah, he trusts us, Marty. Yeah, right. Yeah. So. Okay. So this is your mother's day gift. I figured that. I'm just leaving you here, here for a few days by yourself. So oh, that'd be days. great. <laughs> We're heading down to Miami. Yeah. So oh. that's oh, why I'm going to pick you up. You're babysitting too, so. Oh. So we're staying here for a couple of nights. Okay. And we're going to go over to the beach. Good. Good. It's, little, it's 26 miles from here. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Right? Isn't that what you said? No. 26 miles? No, I never said that. I thought you did. Because I asked. Okay, well, I'll bring it up on my phone, but I'm pretty sure I didn't. So anyways, we'll go down to the beach. Good. We didn't get on the beach. So this is the best way. Well, that's fine. At least I can get to a beach. This is a, like what they call an Air, Airbnb. This is an Airbnb. Yeah, they call this an Airbnb. It's a cottage. Yeah, it's a cottage. And so how much um, do you have to have for like like a, a deposit, like for breakage in that? I paid for the whole thing right at once. And then if I had to cancel, they had free cancel. Some of them don't. Until just, yesterday. Yeah, you yeah, have until to Until 3 o'clock yesterday yeah. to cancel. 
Yeah. Well, that's good. That's yeah. really good. And it was free canceled because some of them will charge you. We yes. Paid, we yeah. just paid it all. So it's our first time. We've never been here either. So, so we made it to St. Pete and we are here in the house. And this is what it looks like. This is the kitchen right here. Cool, cute. I'll show you the outside in a minute. Super cute. Super cute. <laughs> I hate that. Yeah, me too. Super cute. So, there's the kitchen. It gives you everything you need. Yeah. There's a mat and dish thing if you want to use that. It gives you pots and pans, so it's fully loaded, which is nice. And we have a fridge, and they give you some condiments, which is cool. I used to do that. And then there you go. And there in here, they have a few little things. I got paper towels in here and napkins and stuff you might need, garbage bags and stuff like that. They even got some coffee here, coffee filters, which is nice. And here's the living room. Ma's enjoying her time on the sofa chair. It was a long drive. So this is cute, isn't it? Yeah, so. There's Shea Bear way over there in the backyard. I'll show you that in a minute. So we're going to go into the bathroom. Everybody knows what the bathroom looks like, but it's nice. It's a walk-in shower. She, so I can be able to shower my mother. You won't have any trouble. And they also have a shower chair for her. So that's cool because most places don't have shower chairs at all. I found it in my closet. Bruna's walking around, having a good time. And this is going to be our room here. It, I mean, it's small, it's cute, but that's all you need for a few days. You don't need a big, huge place, you know? It's cute. It's very clean. See, they can even smell clean. There's a little closet for us. And there's a the shower chair. And they have an extra chair in here too. So I guess if you wanted to have somebody over or something, you could bring that chair out if you had a family or something like that. It's cute. We'll go into her room. And they have games here. So we can play cards and all kinds of games. So if it rains and we have nothing to do or something or something in the evening we want to do that, we can do that. And this is her room. Oh, let me turn the light on. Here we go. Now she's going to sleep on the bottom. She can't climb up there. No. But it's a nice wide one, so that will be nice for her because that's bigger than her hospital bed. So that will be nice for her. And, uh, they give you a dresser in here, so she has a dresser, but if she has to hang up anything, she can hang it up right here, and they also got a fan in here. They got extra pillows, which I'm glad of, because I brought an extra pillow with me because she has to have her head propped up so she can breathe, because she has a hospital bed in her hospital bed, and she has it halfway up a lot of the time, so... I was like, Ooh, we'll have to put, prop her up a little bit. So she's got plenty of pillows to prop her up. So that's a good thing. And I'll take you outside. We'll go out the backyard. It is a fenced-in backyard. This is a dog-friendly place. Pet. Yeah, pet-friendly. Yeah, pet-friendly. Alligator, whatever you got. Oh, you can bring your alligator too? Well, if you can pet. Yeah. They give you some chairs and table. This is cute. And they got a barbecue here, which we're going to use tomorrow night. Yes, cute. Very peaceful. Yeah. And then I'll show you out front 
we'll go out front. But so we can leave Bruno out here. He can walk out if he wants. It's too bad they don't have a doggy door there. <laughs> I don't know if he'd use it. No, you stay here. You stay here. Come here, Bruno. You stay. So I'm going to show you out front. This is cute. The little thing, and it's cute. It's a it's an old home that they just redid and made it an Airbnb. It, it's cute. And this is he. I guess he put it out here for fashion, or maybe it's his and he just leaves it here. I don't know. That's cute. Maybe it's for me to take for a drive. Yeah. Uh, you better pump the tire up. You used to have bicycles. I yeah. Have air pump in the car. Well, maybe they're in the laundry room. The bicycles. Yeah. Is it locked? Yeah, it's locked. Yeah, pretty cute. Yeah. So for people who are car buffs, would probably like that. Now I think they just have a boat here. I don't think they would let us use the boat. But no. So, anyways, this is it. It's all fenced in. Yeah. So, we're what? To the beach 12 miles? 12 miles. We're 12 miles from the beach. So. That's the closest I can get to get a pool. Yeah, right. I want to get the keys and go in the laundry room. I got to take the trash out tomorrow night because it comes Wednesday morning. Oh, okay. That's fine. I'm going to get the keys and I'll be right back. Shane Bear's got the keys for the laundry room. Oh, oh I see. They got chairs here too. Mm -hmm. Got lounge chairs. Yeah. There's the washer and dryer. Oh my God, they got great. That's fabulous. They got soap here. I was going to bring some because I got to do some laundry for my mom. So, I mean, I wouldn't care if it was, wasn't her, but I have to. So that'll be really nice to use. Nice big tub. Nice. Very nice. Huh. Cool. Yeah, they were supposed to have some bikes or something. But I don't know what happened to them. Because they did advertise that they had bicycles. So, anyways. This is it. So, we're going to get our stuff together. And i got to put some stuff away for our dinner tomorrow. We'll have to still go to the store a little bit. What's that? Oh, that's a gener that's a um, thing. Air compressor. Well then, you can pump up the tire. That's 60 gallons. Uh-huh. Cool. Leaf blower. <laughs> yeah, if you feel like blowing the leaves off the driveway, I guess you could do that. Yeah. So. Cute. Very nice. Alright guys, so I gotta put some stuff away in the fridge and we're gonna get together so we can go to the beach. So stay tuned. Okay guys, you know what? I was just thinking and I think I forgot to turn the mic on when I showed you the house so I'll have to do a narration when I get home and, and we'll do that. So now we're at the beach. We went and ate over here. Very good food. I've eaten there before. The thing was, is they didn't. The elevator wasn't working, so we didn't go up on the top because I need it for her to for the wheelchair. So, um, so we that was kind of a bummer because it's beautiful up there. Um, but so we came over here, and I'm going to show you the ocean. Here we are. This is Gulf of Mexico, everyone. I've done this before. I didn't ever.
going to do some um, photography and I'm going to put it in there so I don't have to do all the work. <laughs> I'll let him do the work. No. It's because it's easier and prettier on his camera than mine. So, anyways, I'll get some of his clips and we'll put it in. So, stay tuned for all that. We'll Alright guys, check this out. Look at that view. Like I said a couple years ago, Monkey and I sat in here and ate and had a couple drinks. Sorry about the wind. We wanted to bring her mom up here, whoops, but the elevator's not working, so. I have, the hotel. The pink hotel's supposed to be haunted. And we wanted to take her mom there one time. It was like $750 a night for a room with a view of the Gulf Coast. Turn your around here. We put the time, the effort of selecting only the best. Every game's gonna be hit. We're looking for nothing but the top. Again, sorry for the wind. There's that sailboat we were looking at earlier. Because we're parked right down there. Actually, just right over there. We're going to be going right down there tonight, or after we get done eating. We're going to sit down there, catch a view of the sunset. It's beautiful. So, there's the brass monkey over there. There's two bars here. There's one on this side. And one on this side. So, okay. So, now.
they ring the bell for a safe return from the sailors and the fishermen. Beautiful. Thank you.